arrived at our spot here at Carl's Bad Caverns and it's just off Highway 62. It's on some BLM. This is where we're going to camp for uh, next few nights anyhow. All right, there's Highway 62 and the road we came in on. That crossroad over there is 772. It's 22 miles just outside of Carlsbad, the town. And if you keep going up the road from where we're camping here, it's only another 10 miles uh, to the park, to the caverns, Carlsbad Caverns. So it's a nice, close, free spot to stay. Good morning. So we're leaving our camp spot here just outside of Carlsbad and we're heading to the caverns. We got up early and we're still the last ones to leave. Yeah, well, it's early is what is it, 845 right now. So it's not super early, but we are the last ones. <laughs> Usually we don't leave till 11 or noon. So this is early for us. Before you explore the cave by yourselves, we have some rules to go over to protect you and the cave. We have to stay on the trail. Do not touch the walls or the formations. Oils in our skin can damage them. Luckily, over there is a real stalagmite from the cave. You may touch that one and get it out of your system. Do not throw stuff into pits or pools. No food, no gum, no tobacco, no flavored drinks. Yes to water. You may get rid of stuff there. Underground, a normal voice can travel for a quarter of a mile and disturb everybody. Therefore, we have to talk quietly. Quietly. Anyone who is younger than 16 has to stay nearby to their adult wallet. Flash photography is all good. We recommend putting phones on airplane modes. They don't gas out their batteries looking for non-existent service. These are the last restrooms you will see for the next hour. Enjoy the greatest show under the earth. <laughs> Entry, it's huge. I don't take a year to explain. A long time ago, then they would have had to use uh, oil lanterns and wow, it's amazing. Yeah. 
inside these holes, they get nests. Uh, We're just doing circles. Yeah. Oh. Now they fly out. Big dark hole. Oh, it's deep here. Oh, they weren't kidding when they said wear, wear good shoes. Wear good shoes? Yeah. All right, so we just finished the tour at Carlsbad Caverns. We started at 9 o'clock. It's currently 1.40. Yeah, it's, uh, usually it takes, what they say, an hour. Hour, uh, hour or two hours. We took four and a half hours. We took our time, though. It was, it was nice to not be in a hurry. It was amazing. And it was pretty awesome. Yeah, and if you come, when you check in, which we didn't know, you can get these little devices and all along the trail, there's numbers and you, the device hooks up to it and it tells you all about where you are. We wish we would have got that. Yeah, that would have been nice, but they did have information that you could read. So. Yeah, and we dressed warm because we thought it was going to be cold and it was 56 degrees, but it's not super hot out here today, so we were pretty warm down there. We didn't take a lot of video in there because it was it was pretty dark, but we'll have yeah. a lot of pictures, a lot of stills to show you guys. Hopefully they come out and they won't do it justice. If you do have a dog, they do have kennels here to kennel your dog for the time you're down there. Yeah. And I would highly suggest it. It was I amazing. Know, yeah, it was incredible. It was. So definitely worth the visit. Oh.